stronger and uh, coming out here and winning the big game this year. Have you noticed a difference in Connor between last fall and this spring in terms of his comfort and knowledge, et cetera? Yeah, yeah, he's starting, he's starting to actually calm down in the pocket a little bit more, and he, he's definitely starting to read defenses a lot better and stuff like that. So, I mean, I'm excited. You know, he's a good quarterback, so we got a lot of competition this year. Kenny, do you look at it as playing for a number two spot? I mean, because Marcus is there, do you say that, you know, I can I can be the number one guy? Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm not worried about, you know, the whole number one, number two type thing. I'm ready to go out there and show everybody that I can do the best I can. And whether that's getting, you know, five carries, ten carries a game or whatever it is, you know, when I get in there, I'll work hard and do what I got to do. I know Coach Butler's a, n a new guy here and, and he's still kind of working in, but have they looked at you maybe doing some kick return to kind of shake it up a little bit? Uh, I'm not really sure yet. He, that he hasn't said anything to me, but uh, we haven't really done a kickoff yet. We've right. been doing, we're focusing on punt and stuff like that. But, I mean, I would love to get back there and return a few balls this season. And, uh, like I said, do anybody can go on the field, go on the field. So. <laughs> And also, can you, you mentioned about you know how, how you felt after the bowl game. How was the team's uh, attitude after the bowl game and trying to get back? I mean, is it a, just a case of really got to avoid that again? Yeah, you don't want to lose at any time. And uh, especially going to the Dome and losing twice, that, I, we didn't like that. So uh, this year we're focusing on really being prepared and you know mentally ready to go, full-fledged and giving 110%. So we're ready to go out there and, uh, and do big things and bring it back home. Thanks, Kenny. Speaking of that bowl game, did y'all – Talk a little bit about that during the winter workouts and maybe use that as motivation. How much did the bowl game come up? Or those uh, last two games actually come Yeah, up? well, it did because, you know, we realized that, you know, when it's all said and done, we had, a, we had a pretty good year last year, but with not winning the championship and the bowl game, we didn't reach all our goals. So this year it really comes down to working hard and accomplishing all the goals that we set at the beginning of the season. How did the winter workouts work out as a whole? I mean, Oh, uh, it was good. Coach Fitz. Uh, Coach Fitz had us working out every morning at 6. You know what I mean? The stadium doing doing hard work, so I mean, I'm excited. A lot of people, you know, grew and got bigger, faster, stronger. So I think it's gonna be a good year for us. What are some things you're working on personally this spring to make yourself more? I don't know. Uh, just just being a, a student to the game, and you know, really getting into the playbook and into the film room stuff like that, uh, as well as you know, getting getting bigger and putting weight on and stuff like that. So. Then obviously at the running back spot, y'all added a guy, Eric Baker, coming yes, back sir. off a year. Yeah. How 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 would you say his first two days have been? They've been pretty good. He's been he's been really explosive. It's like he never left. So I mean, so we're, we're excited to have him back. Okay. How are your preparations different this spring, if at all? Uh, I'm working harder. Every year I'm working harder. So this year I'm working harder than I was last year and the year before. So that's the main thing. Can you sense higher expectations already? Like yeah. Even even if it's not from everybody else, I know within ourselves we expect to do bigger things. So it's we're, we're ready. Would you say getting to Atlanta to the SEC championship and then you know not winning it? It's just that kind of that taste. Yeah, you get a bit of taste team. in your mouth. Um, it's one thing to go, but when you don't bring nothing home, it's, it's like there's no point in really going at all. So. Look, keep look, you keep looking over the top of my head. I'm just being, <laughs> being careful. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, man, so this year, you know, we really focused on going there and actually bringing it back. Because when the buzzer sounds, if you, if you got an L on your record, it ain't no fun.